for clan it is your lovely lady faith and my amazing husband nick also known as the nick, nick Hades. welcome back to our channel you guys if it's your first time coming across this channel please do us a favor and go and like and also watch all our videos as well as subscribe guys and if you are one of the clans like you already subscribe how are you guys doing i hope you guys are really good so today is a very special day because we'll be shooting this amazing video i think you guys can tell from the title it is couples a quiz you guys will be getting to know us a little bit better and i think we'll be getting to know each other a little bit better too you know all right so guys in this couples quiz today uh you guys will get to learn a bit more about who we are um, and we're gonna learn just some things about each other just to see if we do really know each other the way that we think we know each other or uh, Just have an idea of what uh, but we'll see though how uh, this quiz goes, but it's gonna be exciting It's gonna be fun. Uh, so we've, we've got this little plaque over here. It's two-sided You've got one side that says wifey one side that, is, that says hubby. So if uh, so we're gonna do a test who is the funniest for example yeah. And then, uh, Faith, uh, we will both have, let me just grab my plaque. So we will both have plaques. And then if I think I'm funny, I'm going to go for hubby. If I think she's funny, then I'm going to go for wifey. Same as her as well. So uh, we'll get to see. And we'll check um, if we are, if we have the correct answer. If we are in agreement that, uh, for example, I am the funniest. <laughs> or she thinks that she is the funniest. And then it's like, wait, what? There's no way. Okay, but anyways, um, guys, let's not talk too much. Please remember to um, like, share, subscribe. If you have not subscribed, click on that bell notification just so that you can get more videos and uh, more notifications when we post videos just to let us know what we're doing. Like at this stage, I don't know if we're posting it randomly. We're trying to do once every two weeks or once a week, but we'll surprise you with the once a week. And then, but otherwise... Uh, two weeks the game but guys just click on the bell icon and you will get notified as soon as we upload a video just like this one all right for sure okay guys so before we start with our couples quiz uh when i bring in a little bit of even more fun we're going to be including you know some little bit of ones it's like white one it's amazing yeah. we love it it's our favorite it's from woolies so yeah i mean what fun can you have with that you know a little bit of this so um without further ado guys let us get into this quiz all right let's do this okay right. so um guys a little bit of a disclaimer even though i downloaded it online we never went through i only literally just went through one question just to see if it's what i want and stuff like that so you know what when we read this um these questions we'll be as surprised as you are okay mm -hmm. this is not you know um pre what is it Prescripted or whatever, yeah. it's not scripted or anything. So it's gonna yeah. be the first time we get this. Okay, perfect. Let us get into it. I will be doing them a questions. First question is uh who is Messiah? Alright, alright, that is I am I Messiah. am actually you know what? I'm so glad <laughs> not that, that much Ohavi is actually agreeing because we both know who is the messiah between him and I. I'm so glad that he agrees with us, guys. Okay, so the next one is who has the worst temper? Wait, oh. Uh, <laughs> I wouldn't say it's a temper, but uh, she, she gets annoyed quickly. She gets annoyed quite, quite quickly. I think she gets irritating maybe temper okay maybe maybe we'll do this yeah like 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 i use it i go like ah don't you dare don't you dare don't you dare okay but yeah. otherwise but she will start to lose it but anyways i suppose we're in agreement yeah i think we're both in agreement to the happy jazz he has the worst impact not that he loses it a couple of times no but when he loses it he loses it basically so yeah <laughs> Okay, let's go to the next question. Who is the better cook? I'm not even gonna lie to you guys. Oh yeah, I'm gonna... <laughs> I was I was gonna go for you, but it's how are you thinking? I thought he was gonna be a little bit more like, you know what I began day and dope. Yes, Hubby is actually the best cook amongst us, honestly. When we actually met, I did not know how to cook. Most of the things I learned was from him. And throughout the years, he has improved 
tremendously basically i prefer this food more than anyone's food he is an amazing cook you guys so i have to give them that credit yo i have to give them i also am a good cook but we're coming between two of us you both know that i i i say i'd say i'm a five out of ten and hubby is just like a ten out of ten maybe yeah. you're an eight oh. yeah <laughs> okay okay good you want to do the next one all right, so the next one, uh, the next question that we have for you is uh, who takes longer getting ready? Okay, I think this is obvious. We don't even need to do a, a review on which one it is, but it's very obvious. Um, one, two, three, maybe five hours just to get this <laughs> to it. Exaggeration. <laughs> That's it. it takes, yeah, so basically, um, when she gets ready, so we've got two alarms. We've got an alarm in the morning for her and an alarm in the morning for me. Uh, so the first alarm will go off, she gets up, she showers, she does what she does. I don't know what she's doing in there, but she does what she does. And then uh, when she's done in the bathroom and she comes this side, then my second alarm will go off and then I get up and then I go shower. So I get a little extra sleep, maybe close to an hour sleep or something like that. Wow. And then, uh, and then I'll get dressed and ready, and she'll still be busy getting ready. Uh, so yeah. <laughs> um, looking beautiful takes time. Just so you know, guys. I think all the ladies out there know that looking fine takes some time. So yeah, I'll leave you that. <laughs> okay. All right. So we'll go over to the next question. It is uh, who snores the most? Oh, you don't snow. We don't snow, yeah. yeah like, like snow. you have snow once, so and that counts as snows, the most. You know? Wait, you, you snow once, so that counts as the most. Because I don't you snow. snow. You like you do snow. Wait. Well, you snow. You sn but not like <laughs> we don't we don't snow honestly. Yeah, but when maybe you're not sleeping right or something like that. Probably you know? yeah. Yeah, probably, but otherwise. But we seldom we snow, guys. We're not the snow type of people, so yeah. Yeah. That's very, why this very. is a difficult question because we really are not honestly. He, yeah. he seldomly does it like honestly i'm sure if i do snow as well i seldomly do it because i really can't nobody can hear themselves snoring right so yeah yeah well i heard her once but it's rape I heard, I heard <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> let's go over the next question uh do you want to go do you want to read the question who is the better driver i mean this is obvious okay yeah. it's super obvious not not because of the fact that you know women are worst drivers no not because of that saying but because of the fact that my husband has i think more than, I mean, more than 10 years long. yeah more than 10 years of way driving okay way more than that way even than that. so obviously he's the better driver and i have what literally probably almost two years of driving so obviously he's the better driver than i am okay he's a he's the he's a great driver honestly he really is thank you okay. yeah. so yeah the next one is anyway. Who is better with directions? Uh, this is obvious. This is obvious. I feel like these questions are error. not on my side. Put a big error. Yeah, I will. T I am going to yeah. that. I'm getting. Since I started driving though, I am getting better with you know directions because of when I'm driving alone, I don't have a habit to actually you know I don't know his head is like and then you know something he remembers directions even though he's gone through them once. So yeah, I don't do that. I have to go through them like multiple times. But now I have no choice but to actually try to remember the directions, especially when I'm driving alone because of, you know, I'm going to dust and I can't even call home to be like, hey, I'm here, are you already, whatever. But yeah, I am getting better day by day. But he is pleased. Okay, next question. Who swears the most? I I don't know why. Like, we should get a swear jar in the house. And we've been saying that, okay? We have been saying that. The show is just watching. But I have reduced, I believe. Lord help me, <laughs> I think I have. But yeah, like, I can't even say it. Yeah, I was about, like, other words, like, I, I, let me not even say it. But I don't, I'm not like a hectic swearer, you know? But I do swear. Yeah. Hey, have you heard me swear? I do. I do. No, I don't. Not as I, much as I, I, don't I am. Swear. You seldom me swear, but you swear. Yeah, but in a day, I'll like, like today I've never swayed. This week I haven't swore. This week? No way, not this week. Like, like the only time I'd use a swear word is when I'm repeating something I heard from TV, maybe. It's swearing! I feel like it counts as swearing. That's, okay, yes. That's, yes, if it does count as swearing, but only if I'm saying, yo, 
uh, hey, Kevin Hart was saying, and then I repeat what he said, including that sword. That's me, sword. But in a normal conversation, it's like, oh my God, that person is so... Dee, 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 dee. No, that's not me. I will never say that. Uh, I think I'm not, I'm not a swearer at all. Yeah. <laughs> not at all, but yeah, he's not a, he's not a swearer. <laughs> out of 10. Out of 10. Um, I'd say maybe 3 out of 10. What? I'm rating three? myself a what? 1 out of 10. No, no. <laughs> Yo, this is a 10 out of 10. I'm joking. I'm a 10 out of 10. You're right? a 7. You're a 7 Yeah, I was about to say 7 out of 10. You're a 7 out of 10, yeah. Obviously, I swear every chick every single day. <laughs> I guess I'm a 7 out of 10. Yeah, we need a swear jar. So, um, the next one. Who made the first move? Oh yeah, I did do that, didn't what? I? <laughs> <laughs> no wait, you you the one who did it. How did I? Oh my god. You asked me you asked me for a hug the first time I met you, didn't I? Wait, you did that, didn't you? I mean, yeah. yeah I really so can't. that counts I as a really first move. <laughs> That's a first move. Okay. okay if now. it came to asking out, then I did. Okay, if but it comes to I guess who interacted with who first, whatever, I you know. Yeah, I guess it's me. So yeah. I don't I don't know. It's first. When was it? It was 2010. 2010 and I looked like wow. Like, <laughs> like wow. Right. Okay, guys, so next question, babe. Uh, next one, uh, next question is uh, who wears the pants? <laughs> what is that? Yeah, I don't know. Is this like who's the wrong? Who's the man of the house? Something like that? Who, who, who controls or something like that? I don't, I don't yeah, really I don't know. understand. I don't understand yeah. the question. But we are, uh, can we say slightly traditional? Or. To be honest, Nick is he's more traditional than I am, honestly. Yeah. But you know, he wears the pants. You know, he wears like sixty percent of the pants. Sixty percent? That's like ninety nine percent. Ninety nine percent? Yeah, like. What do you mean ninety nine percent? So ninety nine percent of the time, no, but, Nick's. No, we do we do share and split decisions and roles yes. and things like that. So it's not like. Oh, you like you're the lady. You have to go and do this and this and this. The cleaning and the cooking. Or you're the guy. You need to go change the tire. Nah. You know what? If maybe I hear somebody trying to break into the house, I'll be like, Yo, dude, the quality right here. Go check it out. I'm joking. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is? I'm joking. I'm joking. But I will one day try and make her do the uh, change the tire. Yeah, just, you wouldn't know that, eh? Yeah, just for that. practice. Just for practice. Uh, but at the moment, we enjoy the luxury of having people come in and do it for us yeah. uh, because we're paying for that service. Yeah. I don't understand why we need to change a tie if we're paying for that service. Guys, so. if you can, if you honestly, if you have insurance, your car is new, check if you have those kind of benefits. Okay, yeah. there's no point in you doing those things, especially when you're paying, it's included yeah. in your monthly installment. So do yourself a favor and ask these people to come and do it for you, okay? But otherwise, yes, um, who wears small pants? Obviously, you know, Javi wears small pants. But um, as he said, we do splits. We do splits, yeah. Decisions and so forth. So, um, next question, please. Okay, next question. Who said I love you first? It sounds like something that I would do. 100%. It sounds like something 100%. I would do. Yeah, you know what? I'm a I'm a person who loves. I'm gonna, yes. I'm gonna love him. So, He's a very affectionate person. That's one thing I love about him. He's a very affectionate person. This one, on the other hand, I'm affectionate, but with. Okay. Not yeah, she's, she's, a, she's a person who says I love you by saying Have you ate? <laughs> uh, <laughs> are you full? That's her way of saying I love you And not and not the traditional words I love you oh my This God. kind of stuff <laughs> <laughs> Did you get to work or fine? Oh kind my of God. Stuff. That's, yeah. But that's uh, what she does say I love you sometimes I do say I do say yeah. I mean, like, yeah. Not as much as him do say it. it's not like I don't say it, yeah. so please do not drive me the same way. I do say it, okay? Yeah, I think my problem is that I'll say it 10 times. No, not 10, 10 is even a new level. I, yeah. In a day, I'll probably get to a thousand. Yeah. I get to a thousand. I, I, I could, yeah, he does say that. So many times, and he also shows it in his actions as well. So probably 1,000 times, 1,000 times. Yeah. Time, yeah. <laughs> That's how he eats. So, next question. Handwriting is nice. I believe my handwriting is nice. I'm a girl. I'm a woman actually. I'm a woman, so I do believe that my handwriting is. 
Yeah. But not to say, I'm not saying, you know, on all male's handwritings and I'll get I'm not saying that. I'm just saying between the two of us, my handwriting is better. Yeah, I've got a doctor's handwriting. It's a uh, it's a it's a high IQ thing. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm <Wow>. joking. <laughs> Okay, so who is the better dresser? I mean, dresser. Yes. Who is who? Who dresses the best? Yeah, I know. Do it. Obi, yeah. lunch bar is me. Yeah, but I think Let's it depends on what I think it depends on what we think better is. Are you who's more comfortable? I think I'm more comfortable. Who's more? Um, whose clothes are more like? Like if you get chased by a dog, I can bolt. Oh, you know, my God. <laughs> it's better to be ready and prepared for anything that the world uh, can bring to you. Uh, weather, I'm always prepared. I'm like, if it's cold, I'm prepared. Um, I know a lot of women when it's cold, they still wear crop tops, and we still gotta give away our jackets. Uh, <laughs> so I think when it comes to preparation and things like that, I'd say I'll be winning. But when it comes to Visually looking aesthetically good. Aesthetically pleasing. Aesthetically, yeah. Yes, she, she I think that's what they mean. Aesthetically pleasing. Obviously, I was And I'll see. Next question. Yes. Uh, who is smarter? Are you okay? <laughs> smarter. I mean, I, okay. Nick is very smart. We're very smart in different ways. I am. I'm book smart. Book smart. Yeah. When it comes to general knowledge, yeah, this person knows a lot of things. I have so many things I have learned about the world that in general comes from him. I just yeah. okay. Me, on the other hand, I just pick something. Like, okay, I want to learn about, I don't know, about papers. I'm not going to learn about papers, but just I will do my research. I, I don't do general knowledge stuff. I just only learn about things that will interest me and benefit my life and help me with self growth. That is it. So, I don't know then who's smarter, but yeah, I can in that case I'd say both of us are smart and good because we are both smart in different areas in our lives. But we also one thing we are both smart on is street smart, okay? We both good. Yeah. We're both smart and street smart. I mean street smart. So yeah. Yeah, we can get away with things. Yeah. Bicycle. Yeah. If you want to know about the theory of relativity or quantum physics, I'm your guy. Uh I'm a nerd. What do you mean? <laughs> No, it's just that I care about, well, I like to know a little bit about everything that is everything. That's my kind of thing. That's my thing. That's my thing. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> All right. So, let's head over to the next question. Who is funnier? Didn't take that long. This guy. I, I'd say I'm funny to be honest, guys. But, but, I would say, this is the thing about me and Nick, okay? I am funnier around people. Nick is very, 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 very funny. Around everybody. Wow. <laughs> He's very, very, he is funny around, but mostly he's funny when it's like indoors, around close people, whatever. He will, yeah, he will say some weird things that will actually make you laugh. So yeah, I think we both are funny, but I will say, obviously, besides myself, Nick is the funniest person. There you go, I thank know. you. Like, thank you. If if one of us could have a career in stand-up comedy. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, let's look at another question. Uh, uh, who is more creative? Oh, my God. You know what? You know what it is? It's one of those things of, I don't know, the, the left and the right side of the brain. There are people who are more um, book smart, you know, those kind of... Realist, dreamer, and exactly. Yeah. So, like, she's a realist, and I'm a dreamer. So, I think dreamers are way more, like, in terms of creativity-wise, they are on that department. They are, I'd say, fun, funny. They are creative. They think outside of the box. Yeah, I think outside the box. We, we love color, uh, but uh, people who study accounting love the blacks and the whites and the greys. I'm Nothing around, <laughs> by the way, but yeah, I would like yeah. Nick is way more creative. The reason why, I, you know what, I, if you ask me a couple of years ago if I was creative, I would say no. But 
but now I would say I'm getting there because of the influence Nick has. A couple, I think, what was it? Was it last week? I'm not sure when. I did a cool reel, right, of um, how to look thin or ever. If you guys follow me both on YouTube and Instagram, you will see that reel, um, how to look thin or ever, whatever. I came up with that idea, but Nick kind of twisted it in a way that's actually cool by adding some effects and whatever. And yeah, I don't think that us out of the box. It's like, how can I? I did not think of this, honestly, <laughs> but he made it way 10 times cooler. So when he comes up with these type of ideas, it unlocks my other, you know, left or right hand, right? Left right. or right brain. Yeah, like left that. or right brain for me to actually become a little bit more creative. But yeah, man, um, he definitely is more creative. I, the fact that I'm getting creative right now is definitely wholeheartedly him. He's the best creative out there. Oh, thank you. Thank You're you. welcome. Uh, you want to get the last question? Yes. <clears throat> The last question. This one is we save in the best for last. What? Paul, who spends the most money? Oh. Shaka, right? In cases like this, to be honest, you would think the wife is the one who spends more money. Clothes, hair, everything. No, friends. Hubby spends money. The money, the show. <laughs> yeah, uh, the only thing that I can say is that life's too short. You know, live life to the fullest. Be <laughs> happy. Do whatever makes you happy. If that T-shirt that you see in the store is gonna make you happy, you know, if you watch a Steve Compeller's video, it's like buy it, buy it. Whatever <laughs> makes you happy, do it. And if that has happened, my man, there's a pair of sneakers you want and your budget is tight. Forget the budget. Look after your emotions. Go buy that pair of shoes. It gives you positive energy because the world is up against you. Do it. Do it. I'm that kind of person. I'm that kind of person. All the time, yeah. All the time, yeah. All the time. We know what it's he happiness says. Happiness first. When he says it is what it is, life is the joy. Then I know for you know what money is coming out of the bank, yo. But yeah, the thing is when he spends, he doesn't spend the money always on him. This type of things. When he spends money, he does it for both of us. Because me, I sh I'm the opposite of spending money. I'm thinking of it. So you will not hear a single word from me saying, oh, maybe we should get certain things for ourselves. Or get all of us. He's the only be like, yeah, let's, you know, let's get, let's treat ourselves. It's been a, a rough month or it's been a rough couple of months. Let's do those type of things. So I don't think, you know, that hurts anyone, especially when it benefits both of you guys. But yeah, he's been the most. That's what I want to say. Yeah. That's fine. We're not guaranteed tomorrow, so why are you hoarding all that money? <laughs> if it goes, it goes. We'll figure it out tomorrow. <laughs> okay, guys, so this is the end of our couple slash spousal quiz. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as we did, and I hope you got to know, you know, you got to know us a little bit better. We also got to know ourselves a little bit better. And actually, for some of the questions here, yeah. But anyways guys, maybe you guys should try it out. If you have a bay out there, you know, go try out these questions, get to know your bay a little bit better. But otherwise guys, do not forget to like this video, do not forget to comment. What was your favorite question? What, what were you shocked about when you would be asking these questions and you found out certain things about us? Let us not let me let us know down below, y'all. Otherwise, guys, we will see you on our next video. Stay tuned and stay safe. We out. Peace.